Thousands of opposition supporters protested across Ghana on Tuesday against alleged irregularities in the electoral roll. Voters will be heading to the polls on December 7th in what is one of Africa's most stable democracies. However, leaders of the National Democratic Congress Party have accused the Electoral Commission of illegally transferring voters to different voting stations without their knowledge. Ghana is the gateway to Africa. In the capital, Accra, protester Carla Wampasika said what they want is an independent forensic audit to rid the register of errors. For us to have an exclusive, very well-planned register that we know we are going to an election so that when we win, we know we've won. When we lose, we also admit we've lost. The Electoral Commission has said identified errors have been corrected. In August, it suspended a district director in a northeastern town for allegedly using his credentials to transfer voters without their knowledge. However, allegations of irregularities dent the electoral authority's image. Trust in the commission is at a historic low, according to an Afrobarometer survey in July. In addition, the last election, in which eight people died, was also marred by opposition accusations that the government had unfairly influenced the outcome, which it denied. The upcoming election will pit ex-president John Dramani Mahama of the opposition NDC against current vice president Mohamedou Barumia of the ruling New Patriotic Party. They are vying to succeed President Nana Akufo Addo, who is stepping down after serving the constitutional limit of eight years.